going on everyone? It's Rich Lux and in today's video girl we're talking about rice gum and Gabby girl drama girl start the video Miss Thing I've been getting a lot of messages girl about this potential lawsuit Does rice gum have a lawsuit rice gum is willing to take legal action against Gabby I think it's safe to say that maybe Gabby is exaggerating. Girl, I'm trying something new with this sickening pink eyeshadow, girl. With the steel of glitter, girl, I gotta blend that out, girl. So I was thinking to myself, does Rice Gum have a potential lawsuit? And I asked a couple people, because there's a lot of little lawyers in the comment section, girl, of my videos, a lot of people in school for law degrees. And some of you were saying that he does have a Defamation of character lawsuit. Now we live in a world where you can sue anybody for anything. She said that he hit her and then she retracted it and said, well, no, he didn't really hit me. He just took the phone out of my hand, woo, woo, woo. But the thing is, Rice Gum is getting a lot of messages on Twitter. A lot of people are saying, you hit a girl, you hit a girl, and people are just taking it for face value that he hit this poor child. And so he's getting labeled as like a womanizer, a woman beater, when in all actuality, that's not even the case. Which at the end of the day, it's affecting his money because he lost over 4,000 subscribers last night, girl. Check his social blade, girl, the numbers are there. He's losing, he's losing subscribers like crazy, Miss Thing. So then I was like, well, okay, he does have, I would say he does have a case, girl. People are blaming him for stuff he didn't even do. There's lies. She put it out there. Now all these people think that about him. Rice Gum is saying that Gabby is lying, exaggerating, saying that Rice Gum hit her when he didn't. Again, because she has millions of subscribers, everything is blown out of proportion when you have that many subscribers. A lot of young little kids on the internet, they just see it for face value, run with it. It can ultimately damage his brand. But then she, I think she also has a case against him because she could say, well, I have these scratches, I have these bruises, he broke my phone. So it's kind of like he could sue her and she could sue him. But then if you look at the technicality of it all, she left the scene, she didn't get a police report right there and then you get what i'm saying so that's something that she could also like that's something that's against her because she was snapchatting it too busy snapchatting it instead of calling the police so i think she i don't think she has much of a case against him than he has against her but girl who knows i just feel like do i think he's gonna ultimately sue her it is a possible chance but maybe they can settle out of court and then she could just send him a couple dollars and they'll be done with it but I don't know. It's very interesting to find out what's going to happen, girl. You know, because I really want to know what the tea is. But but most importantly, I come, I jumped on this video because I want to know what you guys think. Do you think that she has a case? Do you think that he has a case against her? Do you think he should even pursue it? Is it even worth it? You get what I'm saying? I hope you don't think like I'm going crazy here, girl. But I think that there is something there. And with that being said, girl, let's highlight is for the gods. Can no way touch me, girl. You ever do your makeup and then you're like, girl, I think I should start over. I'm looking like a little bird right now. I look, I'm giving you very bird demon, girl. I think it's kind of cute. I just gotta blend it out, girl. Can't get no mad if you don't blend it out. All right, so I do have a unboxing, some subscriber mail, and I'm really excited to open it. So I thought I would open it with you. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next video. Peace.